hey, this is my hitty, everyone. Uh, I got my new camera, and I'm ready to make this tutorial. Uh, this guy named Cleve Douglas, he commented on my slow-mo tutorial, and he wanted me to show me, uh, he wanted me to do tutorial on how to import a video file, adding opening titles, and adding overlay titles during the video and end credits. Now I'm not going to get into the exporting the, to DVD or various transitions or all that stuff, but I am going to show you the rest. Let's go back into Pinnacle Studio and let's just close this for a second. So, first of all, what I'm going to show you is how to import a video file. So what you're going to have to do is go up to this top right corner and click import. Once you've done that, you're going to select your device to import your media and then you can look through all your folders on your computer and look for the right files you want to import. You can check all of them or you can check the ones that you want to import. Do all that stuff. Also you can click here and open up that way open up by um it can be if you want to import just one video or stuff like that you can also make watch folders so it automatically imports if you would like any more help with that uh please let me know about the watch folders and stuff maybe anyway we're finished with the importing in this video next we're moving on to adding titles so here I have a little video for you, and I am going to play it. I'm going to toss a ball up in the air. In order to do it, you need to flip your hand up and toss it in the air. I caught it. Thanks for watching. Alright, so here's a video of me throwing up a ball and telling you how to throw it. Pretty simple, right? Just a little demonstration. So after you have your clip, you're going to go to the beginning of the, of the clip, the whole movie. So it's on the first frame. And, and you can do whatever you want. I usually like to put my title on the same track as the clip. So what we're going to need to do is go to create title, then add something such as let's begin, like that, something like that, and then you can add motions, just go through all this. I usually hit page fade for enter and exit, or sorry, wrong one. Now you can just browse through do whatever you want I'm not in charge of you so we're gonna let this render anywhere I'm gonna show you how to make a title during a video so what you're gonna need to do is click the track above it if it's on the same track or below then it will not show up so I'm warning you do it above alright so create a title like that. Put it in the position where you want it, of course. Then I'm gonna do something. I'm gonna do something funny here. <laughs> if it shows a black screen and you wanna see like below it, go down to the bottom right corner and click solo so it shows up. <laughs> I fail. Something funny like that. And then you can add motions and stuff. I'm not going to get into that because I want this tutorial to be nice and short. Finally, with the end credits, you're going to want on the same track. You're going to put your scrubby thing, your draggy thing at the very end, the last frame. And create another title. And you can put something such as, thanks for watching. Now you can type whatever you want, but this is what I usually put, or what I would usually do in this situation. And then you would go to motions, just finish typing whatever you want, go to motions, and I specifically would re recommend emphasis because you would do the um, credits effect. 
the roll down. So you just browse through that. If you want roll down, you can. And you can adjust the length. If you find that it's too... If this is taking a long time to scroll down, or if it's going too fast, you can make it shorter or longer. Anyway, that's it for those tutorials. If you need any help with the importing or the titles or any of that stuff, I can I can give you extra help. If you would like to do a, me to do a separate tutorial on transitions and yeah, I'm not going to get into DVD stuff, but if you want to do transitions, I can help you with that. Anyway, thanks for watching, and thanks for all of your support on my videos. Thanks for the 5,000 views on my first tutorial on Pinnacle Studio, the reverse effect. Anyway, thank you for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in my next video. I have no idea what that will be. Adios. Thank <laughs> you.